Hi guys, welcome to the Big Three, my sweat with air tears, and as I say every time, strive, thrive, live, and live the life that you deserve. So today I'm here at Coogeon uh, Leagues Club in the top of New South Wales, where we are uh, at the Moo Ozfest. The Moo Ozfest is a festival uh, of 44 acts, it is going for 12 hours today, um, and if you look to my left, beautiful markets and then if you look to the right as well you'll see also the stage and also some clothing and some other fantastic therapies there for the community to come and enjoy so this is a 12-hour event so we'll be here from ours uh, well uh, firstly I'd like to introduce my good friend everyone hi this is my good friend Shane Taylor Shane uh, and also the man behind the camera there Terence Kia ora Terence he is uh, they both uh, volunteered to come along and help me today just to spread the word of Bamboo Projects and the ethos of what Bamboo Projects is about. Uh, but I did want to introduce you to one of the guys, and this is my good friend, Shane Taylor. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry about the late delay. No, that's okay, bro. We all get that. Um, so I did want to sort of um, introduce you to the volunteers because uh, oh, this is a, this is a big thing for me to do, and also it's a big challenge for myself. So. It was, a, it was quite hard to find people to actually come along and volunteer a day at their time. So I did want to introduce the volunteers to give thanks and also show you, uh, in essence, uh, what, where these guys come from. So Shane, how, how, did, how did you get involved with, with this event today? So, well, as, as you know, we know each other from a program called Man Up, which is a 15-week program which is making fathers better husbands, better fathers, and better leaders for the community. Mm -hmm. And in, the, in the, my time working along with Man Up, I've come across to know yourself. And then you brought, you brought this up to me the other day, said if I'd like to come down and volunteer. But then when I actually done a little bit of homework about Bamboo Projects itself, well, I was interested. Yeah, that's awesome. Hmm. Um, and uh, Man Up is a program that was designed to, as Shane said, help men become better fathers, leaders in the community, and also uh, better men. Uh, by talking on student subjects such as jealousy, running away, heartbreak and also how they take on adversity and how they can start to retrain their thinking within a controlled group, um, and which is fantastic. So, But today with Bamboo Projects what we do is we go and we give a uh, type of therapy in the form of outdoor therapy uh, where we go like to take people out uh, fishing or hiking, walking, running. We also do a lot of endurance events to promote health and fitness as well because there's such a great benefit to health and fitness but once you get through that health and fitness you, you, there's another part of you that needs to needs help and that can be your mental health uh, so Shane yourself like yeah. have, have you had any issues yourself or have, have you come from anywhere you you seem like a well-traveled uh, person yeah well my my mother yeah. suffered from no mental health yeah. you know, and she and she was a victim of suicide mm. and then um, as, as in myself, you know, everyone struggles through, oh, wow. through anxiety, you know, yeah. and depression. Yeah. And during that time, I've learned to, you know, overcome certain obstacles, which I have found to be beneficial for myself. Yeah. But noticing what Bamboo Projects has to, you know, incorporate with challenging yourself in yeah. outdoor fitness is something that you got to be, you got to be a part of. You got to start believing in because there's fellas out there who will say no. Yeah. But yet, giving them a challenge that's giving them an obstacle course that they can deal with mm. on a daily basis, and it's challenging them physically and mentally. Yeah. Those challenges will overcome everything, which is something that I can stand for. Yeah, exactly. And something that I love to. That's why. Thanks for being yeah, with you. Man. Thanks, man. Um, we really appreciate right. you coming along yeah. and volunteering and helping out. But also, it's good to know that the, the message is getting conveyed to other mm. people, and that they're willing to help because they believe in that message. Oh, of course, I, lo I love the course. Man. Yeah. So, where are you from? I uh, mean, I'm from a little place called Kaitaia, yeah. top of the north. <laughs> <laughs> There's a little shout out to the uh, top of the north island. Is that north? My uh, Takatu, four and a half hours north of Auckland. Oh, there's your iwi right there, my brother. Yep. Yeah. I represent the iwi. <laughs> <laughs> and you've been in Australia for how long? I grew up here in New Zealand, so I had the best yeah. of both worlds. Oh, and wow. I, I now am, and I've been in Queensland now for just over probably 12 years. Yeah, fantastic. Um, and what does the future hold for you? Where are you going? Uh, at the moment, uh, work work is one of my main things. I run a security firm, so I'm just yeah. had to do a company overhaul on that. Yeah. Start rebuilding that, but at the same time, rebuild myself. You know, so I can look at, you know, this time round, 
generate with good positive people and that's how I surrender myself yeah. with you and with the man behind the camera, Mr. Terrence. Hey Terrence. So, yes. Yeah. Um, and that's a, a really fundamental thing that I think that we've learned through life now is that the people who, are work, who we surround ourselves with are the ones that are going to help us oh, grow the most. Positive vibration too. Yeah, and that's emotionally and that's financially and that's spiritually as well as for ourselves. And yes. when we help, we help others, we also help ourselves. Yes. It, it's a return thing. Yes. Yeah, that's fantastic. So, um, anything you're looking forward to today? I noticed you're having a look at a uh, few of the food vans here. Always food for me. You know what I mean? It's always about the food and Queen. Yeah. The Queen experience. Big fan, Freddie Mercury. Yeah. Oh, oh big fan. I mean, we were talking last night about yes. a lot of the old school artists, such as George Michael, we talk about El Elton John and Madonna. Yes. So, you, you love the classics? Love the classics, mate. Yeah. So. Oh, I'll, be, I'll be down to watch a bit of Freddie Mercury. <laughs> We're in for a treat today. There's 44 big name artists that are playing here today over the whole course of the day. The first band comes in at 10 o'clock and then finishes uh, at 10, 10 p.m. So that's a, a fun filled day yeah, awesome. where we not only get to enjoy the environment of the uh, entertainment, but we also get to go out and yeah. we get to pass the message on to the community. So a huge thing with the Big Three and Bamboo Projects actually being here today is actually to spread the word of what we do. We do do a lot of community events every month. So I am looking to start to do more community events here, such with bouncy castles, art and crafts. We take people for walks or fishing and go do outward activities so we can actually bring people in and see if the people who are going through mental health issues or going through bad times can find a place where they can come to and is easily approachable. Totally. Totally, yeah. I'd like to say thank you to Corey for bringing us down in the Bamboo Projects for being, for me being able to be a part of it today. You know, I'm looking forward to it. I love the benefits and I love the cause of it. So come down if you can support this. And I'm all for it. So yeah, guys, it'd be great. And thank you again, Corey. Thanks, brother. Awesome. Yeah, man. Terence, do you want to give a little shout out there, my friend? Thumbs up, bro. There we go. <laughs> Enough said, my friends. So as I said before, this is the big three and the Bamboo Projects, where we are both working together, not only to cure depression with water, but also promoting growth through challenge and strive, thrive, live. So if you are in the top of the New South Wales or bottom of Queensland, come down to Cudgeon Leagues Club. Help us to help uh, the Moo Ozfest raise money for homeless shelters. So yet again, thanks for everything. Thanks for watching. Love you all. Peace. Cheers, guys. Peace.